seen everybody running down there, and that's when they told me that uh, somebody had been hit here at the tracks. So I went halfway out in my yard, and I just screamed because I knew it was somebody that, you know, Tina knew. You know, I just ran as fast as I could down to the crossing, and I got down there, and I, you know, I was like, oh, it's Christy, and, um, you know, the train was there, and I just, and I, I don't know if the window was busted or if the window was rolled down. I just know that I could, I could reach her, you know, I just was just stroking her face and, you know, telling her to be still, you know, help's on its way. We found her cell phone and we're, I'm just kind of scrolling, looking for home, you know, mom, dad. The phone rang, found out that Christy had been in an automobile train accident over in Kentucky and she was being air cared to University Hospital. I knew that at that point that things probably weren't very good. And then finally this doctor came in and I guess being uh, the optimist that I am, I figured she was gonna tell us that, you know, Christy was banged up, but she was all right. But the doctor walked in, she was a young lady, and she backed up against the wall. And I knew immediately that Christy was gone. 